to the world. So, Ama is ready. Auntie Christine is ready. She she came here expecting to see Zipper. You're supposed to be out already, by the way. Hi. Akong, say hello. Zipper. Akong is ready. We're all ready. The cab's already downstairs. We're so not ready. <laughs> Are you ready, Zipper? Hello. It's right. week 41, beginning of week 41. Um, we've tried a lot of induction things. It's a week late. You're a week late, Zipper. Um, uh, 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 <laughs> Obviously, we're, we're still in good spirits. So, yeah. I'm still smiling, well, no, laughing. We, He's we still making nervous, jokes. We have been nervous, but there's kind of a calm nervousness yeah, at the moment. Because yeah, because we were expecting to come to the hospital under contractions and yeah. like and having gone through tra contractions for hours so before coming to the hospital. It, we're just going to get this done without being rushed to do it. We've chosen to come now. We're getting and induced today. We're getting induced today. This is your very first room you'll be in. Uh, if all goes to plan, this is your very first yes. room. I hope you like white ceilings, recessed lights, and maybe you'll really like so oh, chocolate. Oh, <laughs> There's a chocolate. Look at the yeah. chocolate painting. This is your first bed. This. This is where you'll be lying down, crying, going, what the hell is going on? <laughs> like, what I is was all comfortable place? with an umbilical cord. Oh, now they're here to do the, put oh, in the cervi oh, cervix, cervix oh, dim, whatever it's called. We're gonna, yes, yeah, so we're gonna so induce you first with cervidil. It's gonna soften the cervix. And then, and then hopefully that'll induce some contractions, so which are gonna be cervidil. really painful. Okay, <laughs> all right, we're gonna start doing <laughs> stuff now. We're gonna be in this room for 24 hours. It is now three o'clock, uh, about an hour and a half after they've put in the cervidil. Cervidil. Something, I think. That's and now they want to do, they want to give me another oral medication, which is. Cytotec. Cyto Cytotec. Yeah. Which is also supposed to um, soften the cervix because apparently after putting in the cervidil, nothing happened. Contraction time again. You remember this monitor from maybe a week or so ago. This is the contraction meter. Normal baseline is about 20. Wow, you're having a big one. That little black line there is all contractions. Currently, I feel the tightness there. And then also a little bit lower, I feel um, a little bit more down here where the head of the baby is. I feel a little bit more uh, tightening. So maybe that's my cervix kind of effacating. Effacing? Defecating? Maybe it's her cervix defecating. Da <laughs> bien. Oh, laughing. Laugh laughter actually increases the... Uh... Oh, God. oh no, everything's gone. I know. Oh, no. I can't laugh. Don't make me laugh. The doctor's going to call us going, what's, what's going on. Going on. He's, He's crying. crying. He's already crying. Spicy noodles. Spicy noodles. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Catch the baby. Do you trust him? Yeah, of course. Yeah. You trust yeah. him? Yeah. yeah. I'm not worried. <laughs> Everybody else is worried. No problem. Everybody else is worried. <laughs> This is me administering natural oxytocin. Six twenty six ten ten. Janet's getting um, the first dose of pitocin. We've, we've agreed we're going to do some pitocin now because it's all kind of continuing at 0.5 centimeters dilated. Um, I just feel uncomfortable all over. 
Okay, now we are 20 cc's per hour. We're still good, but I still have nothing going on. No contractions at all? Look at, look at that, 22. Zipper! Zipper, we're going to charge a high fee for your room. Mm-hmm. Amam. Did you hear me? This is Amam. This is Amam. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? Amam is telling you to say it. Let's try 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 it. Zipper? I flew 10,000 kilometers to Taiwan <laughs> to meet you. That's true. So you need to come out now, please. So this is apparently recommended. I think they're just joking with us now. They're like, what, what <laughs> ridiculous <laughs> thing so, can you make them do? So the doc, Dr. Lin just came in. He's opted it to 24 cc's of pitocin. He said, there's if there's no change still, there's been a bit more bloody show, but if there's no change in terms of the strength of the contractions, he wants to break the water, he wants to break the amniotic sac. And he's aware that we want to do things naturally, but we're at the stage that... I'm at, I just, just get the baby out. <laughs> oh, I'm nervous. Great! It's a clear, clear one. No, 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 So anything right now, and we want the baby out. So you just see, just talk to Dr. Lin, see what he thinks as well, and whatever your body thinks, and you know you have that option. No energy. Yeah, there you go, and that could be anything, any reason why. In fact, we've been here for 24 hours plus. The fact that we threw in two, three different types of medication, we have no idea. We didn't know any of this stuff. The botulism, it's not botulism, but uh, it causes dizziness. You're actually having something in you that's causing dizziness right now. So we did not plan for that. So just see how, you know, you've done so well, you're doing so well with it. I don't want to see something. Exactly. So we plan, that is the plan, that's the goal, right? Well, the goal is to have the baby out. Let's see if we can get avoid the C-section, okay? But either way, we're going to have the baby out, and that's the good thing.
Either way, today is the day. In a, in a matter of 120 minutes. I can't last another 120 Yeah. Well, maybe we got some help. Uh, no. She's going through a contraction now. Uh, no, I'm not going through a contraction now. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's really good. I guess so. Uh, uh, yeah. Stress. Is it going to be? Is it going to get worse than this? Do you think? Uh, the pain. Ah uh, yes. No. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, do you think that will help her? Because she feels like she's too tired. Yeah, she's too tired. But, but do you think the pain will help her? Do you think the pain will help her? Because she doesn't want to. She's scared that if she has an epidural, it will delay her. It'll delay and she'll no, be. No, 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 and she's no. already super tired. That's yeah, you're really tired. So epidural will improve. You will feel much, much better. And don't delay the, the, the course. Will she have? She's worried that she won't know when to push and the control. Ah, you don't need to worry because we can stop the epidural and you will feel the so we can the pain totally yeah. pain maybe within one hour. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you can just ride it. You can just see what you want. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, better, better. That's good. Oh. That's good. Already six centimeter. What? what? Nice. nice. That's nice. I will give you a video and re re a little bit release okay. your, your tempo okay. sensation. Ooh, we want to avoid the C section yeah. as much as possible, so yeah. listen to your body, Janet. Yeah, Janet. You're at six centimeters. Yeah. <sighs> nice. And then we're gonna scream at that baby. <laughs> if it dares cry too loudly tonight. She's ready for this. She's ready. The rice will be a piece of cake. After six centimeters, it normally opens up even faster. Yeah. Yeah. We're going through the. We didn't hair expect bit. six centimeters. Yeah. Six centimeters is about this much. Yeah, that's a lot for the cervix. Think of, yeah. think of your pee pee going six centimeters wide. <laughs> Don't scare him. So. I probably will cry too. You I bet know. Jo or George will cry too. Of course I will. Yeah. Can you really cry? Yeah. Of course. <laughs> I cry. Oh, wait, it, you, just you wait. You haven't seen anything yet. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait. Now they're all in the process. You can feel the uterine contraction, but no pain. Feel some tightness of your belt. Maybe he's going to get pain. Don't worry. 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 Don't I just woke up and suddenly we're next. Suddenly Wendy's there checking on Janet. 
saying it's time to have the baby and I'm, I'm still in a daze right now I'm still because I must have just passed out for half an hour whatever it was ready ready yeah okay Let's do this Focus down there, Very good. focus down there. Uh, oh, you can see the head. Ayo, it's so good. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yes. Oh, really good. One more. One more. Keep it focused down there, all the energy being pushed down there. Yes, nice. Really good. <laughs> yeah. That's good. I've done this before, but I don't remember it being so. Do you remember what you did with those three? No. <laughs> well, Whatever you did, do that again. Naturally, yeah. So that's, that's fine. Yeah. Do that again. Three times. Okay. And you breathe. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> breathe. breathe. Mom's not breathing. Breathe. If you don't breathe, she doesn't breathe. Get her some oxygen. Yeah. That's great. Very good. That's cool. Couldn't go any better. Couldn't go any better. Couldn't go any better. Shut the door. Okay. Yeah. It's only been 36 hours. Yeah, it's been nothing. It's been nothing. Nothing. This is the easiest pregnancy you've ever had. Yeah, it is. Oh, delicious. Do you? Waited 10 months. Find out the sex. Yeah. I'm leaking blood and a lot of it. I don't know what that means. Is that a miscarriage or uh, I don't know what that means. You're so close. Yes. Oh my gosh. Wow. I think it's going to break your water. Look at these two. Yeah. Just 
I know, and you're shaking the baby like crazy. Yeah, poor okay, thing. Zelda. The poor thing. Oh my God, you're shaking his head around. Looks cozy. Looks quite cozy. <laughs> Not a burrito. That's all right. Day one of the rest, the rest of, our of our lives. lives.